Good morning, you guys. It's Wednesday morning. We're outside of Publix, about to head in. When I was putting together deals for this week, I did have a lot of stuff to write down, but not a lot of freebies or money makers. We don't have a gift card promotion or anything like that, so I feel like we don't have a lot to work with to get our total down to zero or a money maker for everything, but we still have a lot of good deals that I was going through, so I have a lot to share with you. If there are items that you need or you want for your family already, then getting deals on them and being able to stack sales and coupons and I bought and everything is some amazing savings. So we definitely have some great things to talk about today. I wanted to mention really quickly, I'm going on vacation next week. I'm gonna be at Disney World with my family. Julie, are you excited for Disney World? Mama. So excited? Mama. Are you gonna see Mickey? We're excited. We like to do a big trip for about a week, once a year, but this time it's extra special because I am turning 30 in a few weeks. So I wanted to make this one a really special trip. So I have been planning for this for a while and we are super excited. So next week I will not have a Publix video, but I will be back the following week. So I'll just take a week off from Publix. It is gonna be pretty chilly down there, but I'm sure it's gonna be a fun time. All right, so we're gonna head inside. We're gonna check out some of the hottest deals this week at Publix. The Tresme is a great option this week for the Fetch Unilever Spend 15 Get 5. We have the three off of two extra savings book coupon that expires on the 28th. And this past weekend, we got a new four off of two coupon for Tresme in the 123 Unilever. So you can pair those two together. If you want to complete that Spend 15 Get 5 in one transaction, you could grab four of them, use two of each coupon, and that'll bring you to $4 for all four after the $5 back from Fetch. So just a dollar each. That is a pretty good deal and keep in mind you will get 1% back in points on Fetch for buying Unilever so that's going to come to about 23 cents so it'll be a little bit less than $4 for all four. And that's based off the price of $5.75, but I know some areas are a little bit cheaper. Hopefully you're in one of those areas. There is that clearance sticker on that one Tresemme, but I don't think the coupons we have work on that product. Maybe you could try it out if you want to, but reading both of the coupons, I don't think they work on the products that were on clearance in my store. Another Unilever option we have this week is the Axe hair products. These shampoos here are $4.99. They're buy to get $3 off instantly at the register this week. And we do have a $1.50 coupon from the 123 Unilever. It is just a limit of two per transaction though. So you could grab two of them, get the $3 off at the register, get $3 off in coupons. That's going to come to $3.98 for both of them. And it will definitely track towards that fetch offer. If you're wanting to pick up some men's hair products and you want to use digital coupons, we do have a dollar off for the Axe Hair, and then we also have a dollar off for the Dove Men Hair Products. So you could grab one of each of those, get the $3 off instantly, and then submit that over to Fetch. It's going to be a little bit more than the $3.98, but it is an all-digital deal if you wanted to do that. The Shea Moisture Body Washes and Bar Soaps are $2 off this week. The cheapest one in my store that was not a bar soap was this body wash here for $8.99. The bar soaps are $2 off instantly, but we can't use our manufacturer coupons on those. We have a $2 digital coupon and a six off of two coupon from the Unilever 123. So I'm actually gonna pick up two of the body washes. I'll get $4 off instantly at the register. Then I'm using that six off of two coupon. I'm submitting to Fetch because this is a Unilever product, so that's gonna count towards my spend 15 get five now these two products are over 15 dollars but when i did submit to fetch it did not track the two dollars you get off instantly because it could clearly see that on the receipt as a discount so keep that in mind if you're picking up two of them it's going to take the four dollars off and not give you credit for all $8.99 of both of them, but you'll be very close to getting to that $15 mark, so you'll just need to add one other small item to get there. If you do have two six off two coupons though, I do think it's a pretty good deal to grab four of them for $8.99, getting $2 off each instantly and two of those $6 coupons. After the $5 from Fetch, you'll pay just $10.96 for all four, so if you're a big fan of these products, that is some great savings. This week, the Blue Plate Mayo is buy one, get one free at $4.29. My store has these dollar blinkies that are still up. They're still valid. A dollar off of one. So you can grab two of them. After the two coupons, you'll pay just $2.29 for two. It's a pretty big thing of mayo, just $1.15 each. I have not tried this brand before. Let me know if you have, but I think this is definitely a price worth grabbing. 
Our Royal Rice deal is still going on now through the 28th. The Ibotta rebate went away for a few days, but it is back now for $1.25 back on select flavors. We also still have the Checkout 51 offer for a dollar back on each two. So if you have no coupons, you can grab four of them and it's going to be a 34 cent moneymaker. But if you do have that $2 off of three coupon, you could grab six bags, use two coupons, and it's going to be a 325 moneymaker. The Glisten cleaning products are buy one get one free this week. The cheapest option is going to be the garbage disposer cleaner for $2.99. We have these three off of two coupons you can get from signing up on the Summit Brands website. I'll have a link down below. They instantly send you an email with this PDF coupon that you can print. It makes two of the garbage disposal cleaners completely free. There are a few more expensive products you can pick from, but that is an easy freebie that you can grab this week. The Ajax dish soap is buy one get one free this week at $2.19. We have a 50 cent coupon from Smart Source 116. You can use two of those. So it makes two of these dish soaps just $1.19 or 55 cents per bottle. The all detergent is buy one get one free this week at $5.75. This deal is gonna be better if you live in an area where you can do half BOGOs, meaning you can just pick up one item and you're gonna get it for half price. We have a $1.50 coupon from Save116, but it's just a limit of one per transaction. So in half BOGO, pick up one for $2.88, use that $1.50 coupon, and you're gonna pay just $1.38. If you're in true BOGO, meaning you need to pick up two to get one for free, you can use that $1.50 coupon. It's just gonna be a little bit more for you per bottle. It'll come to $4.25 or $2.13 each. This week, the Carbana Laundry Stain Scrubbers buy one, get one free at $3.29. We have these dollar coupons you can find on the Carbana Carpet Cleaner. They work on any of the Carbana products. So I'm going to pick up two of these, use $2 coupons. Then you can submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on each. It makes two of them a 71 cent moneymaker. I saw Dealing with Dolores pick up these Plantivore burritos and I wanted to try them. So they're two for five. They're on sale through the 28th as part of the extra savings book. We have a dollar off of two digital coupon. And then right now you can submit to Ibotta for 64 cents back on each. So if you pick up two of them, they come to 272 or just a dollar 36 each. It is a plant-based chicken burrito, but I love a good burrito. So I'm going to give them a try. The Morning Star entrees are buy one get one free this week at $4.79. I don't know of any coupons right now that we can use, but we do have a dollar I bought a rebate. So picking up two of them, you're going to pay $2.79 or just $1.40 each. They have tons of options. They have the appetizers here. They also have the veggie patties that you could pick from. If you have not submitted to the Kellogg's Family Rewards site yet this month, they did revamp their program. And this month, if you just submit one receipt with one item on it that's qualifying Kellogg's product, and then you complete a couple quick surveys, you're going to get a $5 Amazon gift card. So if you're picking these up, you could definitely do that if you haven't done it already. I wanted to share that the Scotty's four pack of tissues is buy one, get one free this week. I don't see that that often. So super easy deal. I don't know of any coupons or anything, but it's a pretty good price for getting eight boxes of tissue. It comes to just $2.79 per pack. So if you need these, that is an easy paper product deal. I'm going to pick up one of these Revlon eyeshadow quads. I still have one of these $3 coupons from the coupons.com website. They're not available anymore, but if you still have those, they are still valid. This eyeshadow quad is the cheapest eye product I could find on sale for $5.99. And we do have a $3 Ibotta rebate right now, so it makes it completely free. You knock out an Ibotta rebate. You might be able to get a better deal on a Revlon product at Walmart or Target, but I wasn't planning on couponing there anytime soon, so I decided to pick it up at Publix. I found some Axe deodorants on clearance for $2.44. We have these $1.50 coupons from the 123 Unilever. We used to have Ibotta rebates, but those just recently went away. I'll definitely keep my eye on Ibotta and see if they come back in. But even without Ibotta, just the $1.50 coupons makes it a pretty good deal. And don't forget to submit to Fetch for that Unilever offer. I'm going to pick up one of these six packs of Splenda Shakes. They're still on sale for $7.49. We have a $4 coupon. This one is from Save 1031, which was a while ago, but if you still have it, it's still valid. I think we got another $4 coupon recently, maybe the one to save. I would just look through and see if you have any valid $4 coupons for Splenda. If you don't, there is a $3 printable on the Splenda website. I'll have that link down below. And our $3 Ibotta rebate just recently popped back in. So with Ibotta, and a $4 coupon, you're going to pay just $0.49 cents for one of these six packs. 
I'm going to grab two of these Activia Plus yogurt drinks. We have these dollar coupons up on the coupons.com website, and we also have a dollar digital coupon. They're $4.79 each, and they're buy one, get one free this week. So with two coupons, it comes to $2.79 or $1.40 per pack. I did see in a preview for the new extra savings book that's coming out on Saturday, though, it looks like we're getting a $2 digital coupon. So be on the lookout for that. That could make this deal a little bit better. We can also submit these products to the crave and save rebate i'll have a link for that down below it's spend 20 get five dollars back and it does track over time so you don't have to spend twenty dollars in one transaction you can just submit receipts as you go and this one definitely tracks towards that we have a really easy deal this week on the Vanity Fair napkins. That sign says $2.99, but they did ring up $2.79 per pack. Buy one, get one free. We have a dollar off of two digital coupons, so that makes it just $1.79 for two packs. You can either grab the 80 count or the 100 count. I know there's also a dollar off of two coupon you can get from signing up on the Vanity Fair website, but whenever there's a digital option that's the same value, I always opt for that. Before we get into how my whole haul turned out, I wanted to show you guys this new book that I found in store. It says New Year Savings, and you can actually go online and you can get this book. You can print it from home at getthesavings.com slash new dash year dash savings. So if you can't find it in your store, you can definitely print it there. It's a pretty small book, but we do have a few coupons that you can cut out. There's a four off two tenna. And then on the back here, it just shows a couple of digital coupons that you should have in your account. So it's not too crazy of a book, but if any of those coupons look useful to you, this one is pretty cool because this is cooking vegetables. So we don't always get coupons on vegetables and things like that. This is everything that I picked up at Publix today. I'm pretty happy with how everything turned out at the register. All my coupons went through, no issues there. And actually with digital coupons, I had a few surprises. You can see here the $2 off Shea Moisture Digital did come off for me even though I used that paper coupon. Also the $1.50 Axe Digital came off even though I used paper coupons on those. And then the Vanity Fair, the Plantivore, and the Activia all came off as expected. So the Shea Moisture and the Axe was kind of a glitch. I was not expecting that, so that was a nice little surprise. I paid $39.30 out of pocket before tax. We saved $80.20. I have Mickey Mouse Clubhouse playing in the background because we're getting hyped for Disney and Julie pretty much watches that every day anyway when we get home. So we're definitely submitting to Fetch for the Axe and the Shea Moisture. So I wasn't sure how Fetch was going to track that this time because they've been getting very picky and detail oriented in terms of taking coupons off before they apply that to like your spend 15 get 5. So this is how it worked for me. It did not take off the coupons, but it did take off the $2 in extra savings for each of the Shea Moisture. So this ended up being a little bit under $15 for these two when you take out that four dollars it did not take off the coupons though i still got credit for that so for the axe i did get credit for 244 for each um so it didn't take off the dollar 50 coupon but it was just the instant savings that fetch was recognizing as a discount i was hoping to hit the 15 dollars twice because i already had some in there but i only hit it once because of the four dollars not counting we are submitting a checkout 51 for a dollar on each two so two dollars i'll get for the royal rice but other than that, everything was Ibotta today. We're getting a dollar for each of the Carbana. We're getting $3 for the Revlon, $3 for the Splenda, $1.25 for each of the rice pouches, plus a 10 cent any rice. 62 cents, I think it is 64, 62 cents for each of the Plantivore burritos and then a dollar for each of the Morning Star. Don't forget, if you haven't submitted a receipt over to Kellogg's Family Rewards yet this month, you can submit this receipt if you bought these products. You'll get a $5 Amazon gift card if you just complete a couple quick surveys. So that could be a really great deal if you haven't done that already. All together from Ibotta, it was about $17, a little over 17. I did not hit my midweek bonus, but literally when I walked out of Publix, a new $3 bonus popped in. It said it was, I think, for the game coming up game day or something something like that and it was just a really easy three dollar bonus when you submit for five offers so i hit that today which was awesome 
So in total from Ibotta, I got a little bit over $20. Don't forget for the Activia, you can submit for the Crave and Save. It's spend 20, get five, and it tracks over time. So that is a good rebate to submit for. So for me today, after my coupons and my rebate apps and everything, I paid about $11 for everything here. Keep in mind, I did have those glitches on the Axe and the Shea Moisture, but that still is a pretty good deal for everything that we got here. This is about $120 retail value, so I'm super excited about that. We got a wide variety of items, some home care, personal care, food items, so definitely excited about this. I'm probably going to eat probably these for lunch. I really like those. Those are so good. Don't forget, I will have my Google Doc linked down below with all of the deals that we talked about today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel if you have not yet. Don't forget, I will be on vacation next week, so I will not be posting a Publix video at all next week, but I'll be back the following week and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.